Here we are on the Rochdale Centenary Night, a hundred years since Rochdale joined the Football League, and I'm delighted to say that I've been joined by Dennis Butler. Um, uh, welcome, uh, Dennis, back to Scotland, the Crown Oil Arena, as it's called. Yeah. Now, um, what's it been like to be back tonight and see some of the old boys? It's lovely. I've seen a couple of the lads I played with in 68, 69 when we got promotion. And see horrible faces and people we know, so it's lovely to be back. So you, you signed from Bolton in 1968 and you went on to 156 league right. uh, appearances okay. for the club, scoring 36 goals. Okay. Um, do, you, do you still hold fond memories of the football club? Oh yeah, yeah, it's all, always I've done. Yeah. Enjoy my years here. Yeah. Yeah. And, and, and Billy Rudd was a teammate of yours yeah, in that promotion when he died. Yeah. Has it been good to catch up with him tonight? It has. We, we, we've always kept in touch and we've always, families have grown up together, we've been on holiday. So we're good friends anyway away from the club. But, uh, also, Derek Ryder's here tonight from the team, so it's it's nice to see them again. And you, you so we just said you're part of that promotion side. Um, you know, it, it it was the only promotion in the club's history for a long, long time. Yeah. Forty-one yeah. years later, yeah. did, did he sort of put a smile on your face when you saw that Rochdale got that that second promotion? Oh yeah, oh yeah, yeah. You, you still keep you with the results to do well, no matter you know what's happening. I was gutted last year when they just didn't stay up, but they played ever so well near the end, and we were very unlucky to go down. Uh, 156 games, as we said, but you, you played for Rochdale, um, and, and back then players didn't seem to move from club to club to club, did they? You know, what, one of the players who's played for Colchester tonight, he's had 19 moves in his career, yeah. and, and it just didn't happen back no, then, did it? No, you usually you usually stayed at one club, and if and two, if a lot, that was a lot. <laughs> and, and, and were the clubs usually local to each other? You know, I mean, there's quite a lot yes. of uh, players that move yeah. from. Rochdale to Bury yeah. to Bolton etc right. like that yeah. that's right you, you, you sort of move from um, we, I moved from Bolton of course to here and uh, a lot of other players did the same similar to Bury to Halifax to clubs like that from Bolton at the time and you had a, a, a spell coaching at, at Rochdale as well didn't you I did I stayed on for a year at coaching and then uh, I got a job at Bury as uh, a reserve team coach and quite successful uh, we had a, brought a lot of young lads on and Enjoyed my days at Barry as well. And uh, have you had a chance to speak to any of the, the younger guys that were here, that were, you know, were, were former players in, in the years well after when, when you we've, were? We've had odd, odd chats, but I'll be, be honest, I'm not too familiar with the careers, and then it's difficult to to sort of say how did you do. And although I've kept up with the club, how it's done, and things like that, individuals. Not as much. And uh, the, the the water ember pitch at, yeah. uh, at, at half time, and the ovation that you got from uh, from a Rochdale yeah. fan. No, it was good. It was good. And saw a few faces that I know because I lived in Rochdale quite a while after I finished playing here. So there's a lot of people out there that I knew. <laughs> so, and uh, the, the, the stadium was obviously slightly different to what it was back then. And it's the, unbelievably uh, different. And the pitch as well. Oh, <laughs> everything's unbelievably different. We we're just saying the three of us that like, look at this. It's like a carpet to play on. We never had that. <laughs> Uh, Dennis Butler, thank you very much That's for your okay. time and uh, thank you for coming tonight and I hope you've enjoyed your evening. Thanks again. Thank you.